Warning, this video contains spoilers for Super Mario Odyssey, but it's also got information that's really worth knowing, so, you know. When you're running around each kingdom in Super Mario Odyssey, you'll notice that there's a massive metal block on each world just sitting there. Here's how to smash it open. And this is your last spoiler warning. Once you've worked your way through all of the brutal bosses in Bowser's kingdom, you'll have to follow Bowser to the moon. Follow the story, fight and defeat Bowser, and the massive ring he stole from the Sand Kingdom dissolves, releasing a torrent of those metal blocks and finishing the story. Once you've watched the credits roll, you'll be free to return to any of the worlds you've previously visited. So head back to any kingdom and Cappy will prompt you to head for the block. He'll even mark it on the map for you and there'll be a glowing beacon in the sky to guide you towards it. Once you get to one, you'll be able to crack it open simply by throwing Cappy at it. Doing so will release even more moons into that kingdom. The good news is that all of these extra moons are marked on the map. You just have to work out how to get to each one. So finishing the story in Super Mario Odyssey is actually just the beginning and starts you on your quest towards 500 moons. Happy hunting. So that's how to smash the big metal blocks in Super Mario Odyssey. Stay tuned to Games Radar for more Mario tips. Click the boxes on the left for more content from us. And don't forget to hit that big button in the middle to subscribe for more gaming news, reviews, previews, tips and guides right here on Games Radar Plus.